Catholic Captions presents Reflections on Today's Mass Readings December 4th, 2023 Monday of the first week of Advent May the peace of the Lord be with all of you as we reflect upon today's readings from the Holy Mass. The full text of today's readings can be found in the description of this video. Isaiah 2 one five offers a brilliant preview of God's plan of redemption. In the future, according to the prophet, every country would gather at the Lord's mountain to seek his counsel and wisdom. The weapons of battle, represented by swords and spears, in this heavenly utopia are profoundly transformed into instruments of productivity, such as pruning hooks and plowshares. This transformation represents a world freed from conflict and the beginning of an era of peace and collaboration. God's yearning for world peace is compellingly depicted in the poetic imagery, which also calls on us to take an active role in promoting justice and peace. Isaiah's prophetic vision calls us to embrace our part in creating a world where God's love transforms everything and His light dispels darkness. In Matthew 8, 5, 11, a centurion approaches Jesus, seeking healing for his paralyzed servant. Remarkably, the centurion's humility shines through as he acknowledges Jesus' authority, expressing unworthiness for him to enter his home. What transpires is a profound moment of faith as Jesus commends the centurion's belief, stating that he hasn't found such faith in Israel. This narrative underscores the universality of God's grace. Faith transcends cultural and religious boundaries. The centurion's humility and trust serve as a timeless lesson, inviting us to approach Christ with reverence and confidence, recognizing his boundless power and mercy. This encounter echoes through the ages, encouraging us to embrace a faith that surpasses limits and acknowledges the authority of Christ in our lives. Heavenly Father, on this day, I seek your guidance and grace. In the midst of life's challenges, grant me strength and resilience. May your love shine through my actions, bringing comfort to those in need. In moments of joy, let gratitude fill my heart. Bless my endeavors and guide me in your light. I surrender this day to your divine plan, trusting that your wisdom surpasses my understanding. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, amen. Thank you for joining in today's reflection on the daily mass readings. May the insights gained inspire and guide us in our daily journey of faith. Please like, subscribe, and share with friends. Thank you for being an essential part of this shared exploration of God's grace.